Don't believe everything you read. Get some trustworthy sources and know these people by the fruit they bear. Mm. Seriously, y'all. Everything ain't real. And just because they in your deal saying that they house burned down and they need $10,000, you don't need to believe them. Back with welcome black. black. I mean, welcome back. <laughs> We're still black. We're still Baby. black. Beautifully black. Welcome back to the couch. Welcome. <laughs> welcome back. Yep, yep. Go ahead and subscribe. Go ahead and press that button and subscribe to our channel and let us know how much you love us, how much you appreciate us. Press that ding so you can get it right. I was waiting for the song. Press the bell. Press that bell to get that ding. Hell. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Jasmine. Cool. So, so. There we go. How's everybody feeling today? Wonderful. Great. Beautifully black, man. Great. Okay. And you know, Jazz, because you wasn't here on our last um episode that we had in here. And I had asked the girls, the girls. The girls. The girls. The girls. The girls. How do they feel about being a black woman in this day and age? You know, it is a privilege and an honor. <laughs> To be what a black a woman, I'm so and Go ahead. To worship no, <laughs> Wow. So I love that I have an underscore with my um, <laughs> a testament of being a black woman. But no, I I I would not have it any other way. Woo! Don't Come give them too much. Woman king. Don't listen. By all love. Okay. So By for real, love. God knew what God was doing. God was God when God made me a black woman. And I had said in that other episode, I said, and when I come back, if you choose to get me back on this earth. I got to I, be. I, I let me, let me run this back one more time. <laughs> yeah, it's like a, oh, and the more that I settle in myself. Come on. Mm -hmm. now it's just like, oh, I can't even, it, it's hard to describe, but I wouldn't have it any other way. Everybody want to be us. Mm. But you can't. And possibly bless is discouraging. Even when you change all of whatever you have to be something different, the pure essence of what we are is just mm -hmm. I mean, we are the we are the vibrance. We are the, Come the, on, vibrance. the energy. It's in we our are, blood. we are, we are, and it's a wonderful thing to be. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's my answer. I like that. Yeah. Well, this episode has nothing like to do that. with <laughs> <laughs> nothing to do with that. With that but I did. I wanted I wanted to shine the light. On, on black women real quick and how amazing we are. Um, and today's episode has nothing to do with being a beautiful black woman. <laughs> but I did, I wanted to hear your... Um, Way to start a thing off right. You know, we got black, black women in the house tonight. <laughs> so, but today, guys, we are going to talk about how to survive social media. And I know you might think that's a bit drastic, but there is a ton of people out there in the world that um, feel depressed and anxious and they feel all types of ways when they get on social media. And I want to, you know, dedicate this episode to the people who actually have a hard time getting on social media or even just living in the new age of everything is videotaped. Mm, everything. Every. I mean, concerts, church, everybody's like this. I'm like, there is not one place where we can go and there is not a phone. Even tragedies. A culture. culture. Mm -hmm. I mean, somebody can exactly. be getting beat down. They're going to record it instead yeah. of calling. Instead of calling. And, and I mean, helping. the camera going to be so still. <laughs> Angles. Y'all need to look into that. It's, never mind. No. Go ahead. No, that's what I'm she said. I'm saying the people that, <laughs> that film it. Y'all need y'all may want to look into being a cameraman because this footage is getting stiller and stiller. It's almost no, like they have a tripod. Really. No, what I think is they may need to look at it being a law and mm. making and enforcing uh criminal charges against people that sit and record Watch. heinous crimes yeah. being yeah, yeah. No, absolutely. committed yeah. against somebody absolutely. and you sit there and record it. And record it. At an this point, you're accessory. At absolutely. this point, you joined in. So what's the point of even recording? Like what to say what to, say to, to say I posted first. Yeah. That that I had the original. And footage. and when you post now, news 
these places pay you for your footage that they didn't get. So I'd rather get paid than the help. Right. Them. Absolutely. Yeah. That's what they think. So there's no humane thought. No, we've lost humanity. So humanity is pretty much. Yeah, it's Come gone. on, it's done. Gone. That's, and, that's done. And, and let's not even go to divinity. That's really. Oh, <sighs> my God. The earth we live in. So today we're, <laughs> we're going to just give you a few ways to not let the news, CNN, even just the recent, the recent um, video of our brother Tyree. That video just escalated. Sometimes people, the mom couldn't even see the video. And I mean, it's been posted a million gazillion times. And why? Never mind. That's shit. A million gazillion like times. Yes. And the mom can't even watch the video. And so this episode is for the people who have a hard time getting on social media. Here are some ways to stay sane while we're scrolling and whatnot. Or just, you don't even have to scroll to get social media. The news posts tweets. Absolutely. <laughs> There is everywhere. Okay. So what's the way y'all? First way, honestly, boundaries have really become my bestie in okay. just saying BBL boundaries best. <sighs> then there's that. Yeah. <laughs> um, best. so I, I, I feel like what's been helpful <laughs> for me is definitely setting boundaries, like setting the limits, how much, how, how much I'm taking in mm -hmm. and even how much I'm engaging, like, Yes, as a creative, as an artist, as an entertainer, you know, that is a, a tool that we use. However, right, I am not on social media all day, every day. As a matter of fact, I don't even wake up like that's not my first. And I know that there are people now that that's their first thing is programming. They wake up and they look at their phone and instantly hit Instagram or Twitter or whatever. <clears throat> my mornings, I say my life is not my own, but my mornings belong to me. That does not look like me picking up social media. I even have limits that I actually adhere to now on Instagram where they have a limit that you can set for yourself or, you mm. know, a, a notification to say you've been on here for a certain amount of time, whether it's 30 minutes, 45 minute increments, just give yourself a certain amount of time that you know that's digestible for you. Um, and you don't have to know everything and be engaged in everything in order to be something. The thing for real for you is what can I take in? And then when do I know how to stop? Mm -hmm. mm. I like that boundary set. Yeah. Mm, that's good. Yeah. So set your boundaries. Yeah. Know your limits. Know your limits. And I didn't even know that they had the thing. Um, they do. Where you they have it on your it's, phone. It's a, it's a, they have it on, you have it on your phone and in the Instagram app. That's what I'm talking about in the Instagram. I know they got it on your yeah, phone. Yeah, on your Instagram app. You literally can set it in the settings mm -hmm. for a certain either time limit for the day or to notify you after you've been on it for a certain amount of time. Mm. My little buzzer be going off all day. Mm. Well... Number two, mm. how you can survive social media. Sometimes we're just following people that we don't need to follow. And I know nowadays, our timelines, they throw people that we're not following in there. I don't know if y'all I know. hate that. They'll Sorry, put some people that, that, that you're not following up in there. So <laughs> Suggestive mess. You got to set your boundaries <laughs> on that one. Suggestive yes. mess. Hey, oh, amen. That was good. Job. They would definitely give you a suggestion. And they'd be right. Not for me. For me, they do. I'll be like, how do you know food I'm pages. Food. How, how do you know know I like I these recipes. Say casserole. Yes. Tonight. Tonight. So we're gonna unfollow the people who make you feel like you're not doing enough with your mm. own life. <clears throat> we're gonna unfollow and unfriend. People in news stations and other things that bring our energy to a very low level. We're going to unfollow, unfollow, unfollow. And sometimes those 6,000 friends that you follow, we don't even know half of those people. So just start, go to your list and you cannot, you can't unfollow too many in one day because then they're going to think you're a robot. So just do a few every day. That should just be a part of our self care. Just delete 10 people a day. <laughs> Or more, however you want. But unfollowing and unfriending has saved my social media life. Um, especially that Facebook, because that can go all the way back to 1980. Mm, the first time they created it, when mm -hmm. you had to be a college student. Was right. that Facebook or Mark, uh, what was it, MySpace? MySpace and Black Planet. Don't use it. You love Black Planet, my boy. Mm -hmm. this is Tell you, I still got my email. 
Go ahead. Go you want to get frogging. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead, Pope. <laughs> so go, a, way, a, way, a way to survive social media is to unfollow. You can't look at mansions all day and think that your, you know, that your mental state is going to be in a great space if you're not working toward getting that mansion. It's not enough to say I want it. You got to work toward it. OK, and understand that you cannot just torture yourself like that. Don't follow these people. Start following pages that speak life like mine, Joy River underscore. Mm. The cows. So that's the second way. Unfollow and unfriend. What's another way? Um, <coughs> use it for what it's supposed to be. It's a tool. Use it for a tool and use it for that moment so that you can focus on the present. Meaning, if you're using it for work, social media, I have to be present here, I have to do this, or um, you're engaging with people, or if, you know, even the couch, we have to be mindful that this is the, the time for social media. This is the time, this is how you network. Use it as that. It's, it's not your life. This right here, your life. Focus on the present this is the life. right now. <laughs> like this, social media ain't you. It's a whole persona that honestly, you can do be whatever you want to be or do what you want to want to do. Put on. They really do be putting on. They be like, "Oh, I want to be here. I should be here right now." That has nothing to do with you, sweetie. Let them live whatever life you live. Your life, you stay on you, and you use it as a tool. That's all I got. <laughs> well, and focusing on the present moment, social media can definitely take us away from the present moment Absolutely. in this way, y'all. Um, everything is so fast paced. Get it, get it, get it. You can make a million dollars now. The real, the real thing in this moment is that you can be still and no, just be still. Focus on what's happening now. Not what you trying to do, not what you working toward, but show now, like, am I well? Am I happy? Am I okay? <laughs> Am I breathing properly? Am I sick? Like what the, start focusing on, on what's happening now. Cause I know we wake up and be ready to go get it. Wake up and have your mornings. And cause my life is not like, my, my life is not my, but my mornings are belong to me. <laughs> you know, you just gotta do that. So y'all just please be still. It's okay to be still. In this social media age of go get it. Go get it. Or go, or go, go get go your blood. Okay. Y'all right, I Mary. Mary. <laughs> Tina and Erica. Calm it it's down. okay to slow down. Okay? <laughs> oh, Lord. What, what's next? How, how can they survive social media? Um, by <clears throat> engaging in positive activities outside of a social media. Jesus! And don't pull out your phone when you get there. Oh, my don't God. Read you a good book. Don't be talking about I'm meditating and you recording yourself meditating, talking about me time and you meditating. How are you meditating <laughs> if you had time to sit the camera up and then start meditating? She get them. Stop talking about it's just me against the world <laughs> and me, myself, and I. <laughs> and he got to capture it. If it's you yourself and I be you yourself and I, not you yourself, your phone. Mm -hmm. And the people on Instagram and the for them people likes. On Instagram. Because you posted it for somebody to interact with you. Mm -hmm. If you're interacting by yourself, you're engaging in activities by yourself. Take in that. You don't have to capture it. You don't got to post one leg hanging out the tub talking about his. <laughs> self care. You don't, self -care. <laughs> you don't have to do that. If it's really, really your time, okay, stop. Go run around the park. Go yeah, jog in the neighborhood or something. You know, watch a good movie. You know, knock it off. <laughs> Grow up. <laughs> Where I'm at with it, okay? Just engage in happy things. And you don't have to share that with the world. Take a break from social media sometimes. Just log off and just live life for real life. Mm -hmm. Not social media life. Okay. Well, that's the post. <laughs> okay. So yeah, uh, we can go there. 
Social media. Another way to survive social media is to know that social media is all yeah. a bunch. It ain't all a bunch of caps. <laughs> a bunch of caps. <laughs> this many caps. It's the capstone. It's not stone. cap. It's the capstone. But stone. it is cap. So it's an even balance of cap and no cap, okay? Because <laughs> half the time, some people are on there being 100% honest, being showing their real lives. But I saw a post where a mom was like, y'all need to normalize how how being a mom really looks. Oh God. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Because I'm with her. Because they're showing moms with their long wool trench coats, turtlenecks, no stomach. I mean tights that go around their foot with six inch heels pushing a stroller that matches everything aesthetically. I mean the walls are white, the, the stroller's white. brown <laughs> with, with peanut butter interior, leather outside. And with, the baby foot got a brown sock on it. <laughs> And I mean, the baby has glasses. <laughs> I mean, they are showing us that motherhood is beautiful when it is not. <laughs> it is. I, man, it I is, carry that not stroller. all the time. Come on. It don't, it don't, social media make mommyhood look beautiful. All and the time. All the time. When you do have your moments where everybody together, you be like, look at us today. <laughs> and then you got the ones that throw up odds. on you. And then there's the tub. And there's the tub where you don't even care. Bruise the crease of your arm because you don't be carrying like care. this. I like this. You and you just and didn't have time to comb like your hair. Or, or or take care of yourself. You know what I'm saying? But these mommies is killing it on social media. So moms that are really living that life in real time, be gentle with yourself. It won't look like a Hallmark card. Nigga said Every you carry ball like that to you. It was too young. Yeah, I, I said, this thing could walk, my boy. <laughs> no, Chris. I said, all right, my boy. Me and Paul have conversations. He in the seat. And he, let, he listen, he could walk and he would be like, the chair. <laughs> I like, no, get up, my boy. Let's go. Mommy, chair, mommy. Okay, And then. I like, all right. That's so, but funny. anyway. Anyway. <laughs> I was listen. You feel attacked? I feel seen a little. Okay, we see you both. But I'm just saying, social media ain't really real life at the time. It's the it's the it's the height of the climax moments. And it's like a reel of all the big moments. And social media has a hard time liking and even being a part of the algorithm, your bad moments. Cause then really, I mean, you can post a picture now and that junk don't even get no likes. The people don't even see your picture. Okay, so it's all about algorithm and what's popping. And your real life is popping. Y'all gotta know that. Your real life is popping. It's real. It's you're you're going at a real pace. Instagram will have you a billionaire tomorrow doing forex. <laughs> or crypto. Mm-hmm. Or crypto. Or selling. Tea. Or encouraging <laughs> you to quit your job, quit yeah. your nine to five, and become an entrepreneur. Because uh, that entrepreneur life will have you, what I say, stressed. Mm. So know what, know, know what you get yourself into and know what you're signing up for. Don't buy everybody a course. Dang. Because <laughs> you really ain't like school when you was 5, in it. Now you want to be a film student. T- on 10 courses and you ain't finished none of them. <laughs> ain't even opened it. Ain't even clicked it. <laughs> I gotta go. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Don't believe everything you read. Get some trustworthy sources and know these people by the fruit they bear. Mm. Seriously, y'all. Everything ain't real. And just because they in your deal saying that they house burned down and they need $10,000, you don't need to believe them. Hey, okay. And why are you saying that? I cannot please yes, add. Yes, please. <laughs> hey, uh, okay, okay, listen to me. <laughs> y'all, this is from the bottom of my heart. Um, you better talk to the people. I mean, for real. I mean, from the bottom. Hey, they Amen. not. They not. Hey, when these people say that they give them your cash, your cash out, mm. guys, it's always a scam. It's just, it just always. Especially is. when you don't know them. Especially, <laughs> it, it just always is. You gonna get scammed. You gonna look up, and oops, they send this stuff out to your people. Don't, don't give it out. Matter of fact. You want to know my suggestion? Take it out your take it out your bio. They don't cash need up. take your cash up out your bio. Like it's why just, is it in there? Yeah, I don't. I know. It's I don't know. I keep I keep seeing it. I never understood that. Take it out. 
<laughs> Please. <laughs> yeah, I want y'all, I want y'all to not be scammed so bad. And then you be, hey guys, if you get a message, it was not me. So you thought that you give me your cash app was going. Don't do that. Mm-hmm. That's all. Okay. You better get it. Yeah, know what's real and know what's not. Because they keep getting got. Mm-hmm. Yeah, what's some other ways of surviving um, social media? Because people really be comparing themselves to, especially and if they in the same. Uh, social job. media is not okay. Yeah, so those people aren't really your friends, right? I have mm-hmm. friends. That's a good one. In real life, that if there was a, an idea I needed to flush out, if I had a question, people that I really trust is that, that would go to like a group thread. It wouldn't be a ask Facebook. Because think about it, most of the people that, would you really trust them with giving you sound advice? I'm not saying, hey guys, I'm in Seattle, never been here before, who are a few places, you know, where a few places I should go or eat or whatever. And even still, I'll go to Yelp before I would go to Facebook, but that's just me. Now, sometimes- Where you go? Yelp. Yelp. But that's just me. But that's just me. Um, but I feel like sometimes people live for social media. And this is my example. There are so many things in life, so many beautiful things I've seen. I may or may not have taken a picture. I may not be the best at capturing mm-hmm. to show people that I've been somewhere, but that doesn't prove that I haven't gone. Mm-hmm. Sometimes you miss the moment. As she says, stay present. You miss all the beautiful things that's happening around you because you're so busy trying to record <laughs> to post. Mm-hmm. And then the people you're trying to show what you did they really didn't even care in the first place. So I feel like sometimes we do things for the sake of, I want to go on this trip so we can match and we can take pictures to post on Instagram. Mm-hmm. Not, I want to go on this trip to experience the wonders of this place that I've never been. I ain't going to lie, I'll be doing it. We still I experience. I, but, but, I, but I always end up not taking the photos that I had planned <laughs> because... I be so sucked into the moment, but I ain't gonna lie and say that I don't go on the tr- like. I have an outfit, I had the pictures. I know I'm gonna wear makeup to the beach. I know I be knowing all these things, and guess what happened? But don't Jive you? Straight but in, don't I was gonna say, on. don't you experience <laughs> where you are? Sure. There are people who miss where they are because they're trying to prove that they've been there. Mm-hmm. What about the ones that? Okay, you hungry? <laughs> okay. What about the ones that do what, Nadia? Here we go. It was just real loud in the mic. <laughs> Why? Nah, I'm All right. Why y'all like this? <laughs> Man. What? It's a- oh. <laughs> it was so loud. <laughs> Why are y'all like this? Talking about Pray for me. I'm in the hospital. Oh my God! Oh. <laughs> with 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 the hospital gown you on. You gotta have your arm up like this. So with the hospital band on. And Who why are y'all like this? Crying. <laughs> you just can't do it. Though. <laughs> <laughs> what really? So it's the it's just attention for I'm what though? There. Like for what? If you really that sad, what in y'all head say, I'm so sad, I want to pick this phone up and show y'all how sad I am? Because mm. somebody like logic? me is not going to believe that you're really in the moment and very but what sad. what is the you're, logic? You're the, there is none. It's, there it's is just one. emotion. But you know, some people also say, you know, you get the cap or shit. Of, I'm being sorry, social media, and then they'll say I'm being transparent. Right. Being transparent so who? means leave your phone down and live in that cry. Yeah, because when I'm snotting and crying, it, I'm not picking up the phone. Mm-hmm. I'm barely I'm sending an SOS phone. to somebody to say I'm in this moment, let alone picking it up to record the moment. Yeah, that's Correct. Too, that's too vulnerable. I got to show you I'm crying. And I definitely ain't finna show you I'm in the hospital. Mm-hmm. You better catch the drift. I'm, Her bird I heard better she, tell you in the wind. I heard she was in the hospital, <laughs> but you will not see me laid up in the hospital. Talking about y'all, I'm doing all right. Video. Put your deuces well, why y'all keep laying back and closing y'all eyes? <laughs> <laughs> I've seen that picture. I'm doing all look, right. Look, look at the peace sign. God no, ain't no. failed me yet. I'm still here. <laughs> By the grace of God. 
what? All right. Congratulations, y'all. Three like three shots and a nigga still breathing. Right. <laughs> what? Man, I'm feeling. And of, of course, it is your social media to use as you see fit. It but is surviving stop the us down. debauchery in the circus that stop you're wearing adding us to. down. Stop wearing me but down. But you know those type of people. I've definitely. I will unfollow you. I've already you. unfollowed you. I'm gonna unfollow you. I didn't even give you the and, and mute you on Facebook. You could be a real friend. I ain't gonna you lie. could be I a go real on friend. Media when I have to. You could be somebody that I for real know. Because and what yeah. I don't you want to do. You post you hollering in the you? hospital. I bet you I ain't. I don't want to yeah. do that with you. I'm not finna do that. <laughs> Guess what I'm not gonna do? That. that. <laughs> I'm not finna do that. I'm not gonna tell you what to post on yours, but what I'm not gonna do is follow and the circus it. and look at it. Yeah, mm -hmm. I ain't been to Barnum and Bailey in a long time. Oh my God, I'm praying for you. Need anything? No, you're, you're not, not praying. praying. You're not. Hi. And then what y'all? Anybody just be lying? That'd be the first thing <laughs> I, pray. <laughs> I pray. I'm praying for you, girl. No, no you're, you're not. not. Don't even tell me. I ain't I don't even have telling you that, that I'm praying for you if I ain't praying for you. Because most of the time, I went when I went home. I went. To sleep. Dead to sleep. <gasps> Pray for the people I love. I, <laughs> I forgot. Yeah. I just sent the praying hand. I forgot to say my prayers <laughs> that night. So I'm not finna lie and tell you that I'm praying for you. I'm not doing that. Now, if I tell you I pray for you, I'm dead. But serious. honestly, just for real, that hand. is a way to survive. Stop seeking attention from those that really <laughs> aren't even paying you any inattention. I'm not. You know? Oh my God. Pray for me. Because honestly, you wouldn't walk into a random church and just say, pray for me. And here's but the thing, for, the for real thing, if you talking about prayer for you, everybody's prayers ain't reaching God. Everybody prayers are not G, genuine. Not G. Because some not are P-R-A-Y-ing for you, and then some are P-R-E-Y-ing. And somebody mm -hmm. like me is I, I am I-G-N-O-R-I-N-G -I in you. Oh. Joy. I gotta be honest. Joy. <laughs> Joy. Welcome to you the couch. <laughs> it's time out. We I I can't I don't wanna do some more. <laughs> so y'all, in order to survive social media, we gotta set our boundaries. Listen, do the timer that they got in the settings. And cut your time short, because I know every Sunday I get a screen time and that thing gets higher every week. And I don't want that for you. <laughs> I don't want that for you. So we're going to have to unfollow, unfriend, block, delete, detest. That's what I detest. Joy Mute. will follow you, send you the same video <laughs> from all of her pages. <laughs> Look at your videos from all of her pages. And then her I stopped doing it. Listen. Did I not stop doing it? You I did. stopped doing it. After y'all told me what I was doing, I stopped. And I have not tagged y'all in nothing else. Hey, 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 hey. All I'm saying is shots fired. Somebody got hit. And all I did, I thought y'all wanted to know. <laughs> we gonna always know. But we gonna know. Y'all are on every No, page. but listen, this is the thing. Okay, I have to say, listen. So, I think that what in, in Joy's case, she forgot that the tag was the notification. So, then she did her personal <laughs> notification as a DM. Just in case, hey, just didn't in case see this. you didn't see it from Joy's page, you're going to get it from the couch page, too. And All I'm saying is she's thorough there, with it. get it on Facebook. But have I done it? All I'm I saying is... What I'm asking is, did I, did I respect what y'all You did. You redirected the energy. I sure did. did. You know what? You know what? It's only me and him in the church now. It's just me and him. And guess what he do? He like every last one. Of <laughs> one thing about it. He like every from whatever page I send it. Oh my God. Yeah. I love, okay. love y'all so much. So yes, that's how you can survive <laughs> social media. Tell people when it's your limit. <laughs> And don't just be tagging people and things that you think they want to be tagged in. Oh, speaking of which, well, for real, hey, guys. I want to go. <laughs> these personal notifications, somebody like me, it wears me thin. <clears throat> so, like, if I'm following you. What's a personal notification? I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm giving you the example. When you post something, there are certain people that I have the notif for on Instagram and on Twitter. And even on Facebook, I have the notification set. So, I, there's a little alert that I'll get that say you posted something. There are certain people I want to know everything they post. They post. Mm -hmm. Certain people, you just happen to be somebody that I follow. But the personal notifications, I feel like it's a bit invasive when you just take your little time and decide to then send me in my DM what you posted. Hey, don't do that for me. I don't think I'm 
Oh, yes, you have. Yeah. Joyce done it. Oh, that's first, that's first of all. That's 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 no, 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 no. I, she said she's never. Hey, calm, calm. <laughs> I wasn't saying you do that now. I'm just giving the example. I'm just giving the example of, but there are people who do that. <laughs> and I'm like, let me, let me grace on my own. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why you keep breaking it up. No, I wasn't saying Joy doesn't still do. I'm just, I was giving her an example of what it is. But there are people who do that that are not my friend. Ooh. And I'm like, hey guys, I know so many creatives. And I, I was really nice and pleasant the first time. I know, I'm so excited about all of the great and wonderful things that all the creatives what that I follow what? am doing. What I want. But at the same time, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the people that I follow and I'm going to scroll during my time, but don't force it because it's, it's really, that's going to take and me. And I force it. Don't, don't force my hand. And then if you ignore that, then I'm going to be like, oh my God, you really want to be blocked. Because sometimes I didn't even know you could do separate. You know what I mean? Ooh-wee. It's all good. I know now. One thing was so good to me. <laughs> oh God. So okay. that's how y'all can do it. Like y'all like get it on here. Here we go. <laughs> yeah. And one more time for the real. <laughs> Got it over here for you, boy. Ooh, so that's what we're going to do. I love us. You're going to unfollow and unfriend. We're going to uh-huh. focus on the present moment. Y'all, we're going to just start being... If you at the Celine Dion concert, you need to be so in tune that you see her go. Hey, I'm not I'm not going on live for you to see the concert that I paid for to see. I'm going to stand in this concert and enjoy myself. Yeah, be there. I will take a memento, though. I ain't going to be I'm a memento, but I'm not... I got, I got yeah. videos, but trust and believe I, I don't have videos as long as people... People go trust. on live. They got a whole concert and you looking in your phone. Ma'am, you do know you can see her in real life. And speaking of which, when y'all do lives... <laughs> We don't want to see you in the live. We will if you, especially if I'm talking about at a concert, y'all be like this in the camera. Sing it. And so wrong <laughs> words <laughs> and loud. <laughs> Girl, flip the camera. Let's see future. So that sounds like people that we need to unfollow. We want to see future. What? No, stop it. That was good. We finna stop doing that on the live. It's finna come up, and y'all just enjoy the concert. Yeah, let's go and really sit there and be present with the people that you with. And I ain't saying don't take one video. All right, y'all, let's take one. Uh, uh, put that phone down. Enjoy yourself. Be present in the let's moment. Go. Let's drive. Okay. They, they're they making plans. <laughs> I'm lying. I don't want to ride in the car. Yeah, I mean, I'm not oh. doing any road trips to do anything. I will fly wherever we're going. Yeah, Amen. Yeah. We need a road trip with Tennessee. Oh, oh sure. my God. That's how you survive of- social media, though. Yep. Just that that is doing activities outside that make you happy. Exactly. And guess what? Social media, half of it's not real. Some of these people really bossed up though. Don't get it twisted. Some of these people bank accounts be looking really nice. Okay. All right. So let's not think that it's all fake. But some of it is. Because it's some of them parties I've seen that I want to pull up to. Janelle, Carlos, we come, we ready for the pool party. I would love a Janelle. We are ready for the pool party, Janelle. Bathing suits ready. CJ, can you tag Janelle? Janelle, Please. Janelle, call with the you. couch. We want to hang with we you. We want to hang with Janelle. you. Janelle. Janelle Monet, just we in case hang you weren't clear. With you. You, you have you an are eternal us. follow. <laughs> we are you. Friend. Turn up in us. Come we on. are here. To save the day. And if we engage in those activities that make us happy. We're not going to be on the couch. I mean, we're not going to be on Instagram with it. We're definitely going to be. You're going to see right in the photos. We're, we're not going to be taking that. Baby, y'all won't even know. Have a baby, good time. Baby, I'm going to live that best moment. moment. Oh, yeah. Down. You hear me? That'd be the best. But, uh, yeah. I can't wait. Okay. So, I hope that this helped y'all set some boundaries, unfollow some people. Take recognize, your cash app out your bio. Recognize, recognize where your energy leaks are so you wake up happy and whole. Okay? And um, I hope everybody's surviving out there. Stay black. Love God. <laughs> God, no matter what you do, no matter where you go, no matter where you blow, mm. there's always room for who? You oh, on the couch. On the couch. There's room for you on the couch. There is room for you on the couch. 
Ooh. We ain't gotta scoot over this roof oh, for you see. on the couch. See you. See you. Oh. See you. <laughs> Why did she do that? <laughs> no, you know, you know, he always wants some food sh shit at the end. Oh, God. So, what y'all want to do? Another episode? No. Nope. Oh, I oh my God. Okay, Nadia and Jasmine, or do y'all want to do one next week? Oh my god, I'm so fucking annoyed.